Um, hey, what's up gamers? Welcome back to another video. It's me again, Bullet Satella. And I literally just finished recorded, record, recording like the, the past video that I recorded a few seconds ago. But anyways, I've still got the cup of tea. Um, anyways, today I'm going to be talking about my love for leather pants. Because the only thing I've been wearing for the past... I don't know how long leather it's, it's just leather pants. Um, started wearing them like midway through last year. Um, my mom and I we were at a jean shop and we saw leather pants. They were a size six. I asked my mom if I could buy them because I think I, I've always thought that leather pants were really cool. But she was just like, "No, Tower, those look too small. They might not fit you." tried them on and they did not really well they kind of fit me but not really so we didn't buy them until I realized that wait a minute I really wanted those leather pants yes they were $120 but we ended up going back there a few months later to get the leather pants and I have them right here my first my, my, this is my first round of wearing leather pants okay here they are size six uh super skinny leather pants they don't even look like leather anymore they just look like jeans black jeans but that's because i wore them every single day i slept in these jeans sometimes and they eventually went dull i didn't even know how to take care of them you know what i mean <sighs> and i wore them and i wore them and i wore them until i ended up undergrowing them <laughs> You know, because of all the cardio and stuff. I talk about that a lot, I noticed. I sincerely apologize about that. Um, and so, because I undergrew them, and I did not know how to take care of them that well, they were kind of um, um, not, not the best, not suitable for myself. So my mother was just like, you know what, Tower? I will get you some new leather pants. And so these are when my new ones are here. I'm wearing them. And I've actually learned how to take care of them. Like, take care of my leather pants. I used to use hairspray because I, I figured that that would make them shiny. Turns out it did nothing. Um, well, it made them shiny for like a couple of days. But then it just wore off. Well, either I found a better technique because you see, I'm not sure if leather polish is going to work. Plus, that stuff's expensive and I can like. I cannot find it like anywhere. Um, so what I instead decided to do is use silicone spray. Yes, it is the same stuff my mother uses to um, make the treadmill slippery, but it's also great for making leather pants shiny. You know what I mean? So now my leather pants get to be shiny. By the way, these are these are a size extra small. Um, I'm getting kind of disappointed though because like, what if I undergrow these? And what if there's no extra, extra small, desperately need really tight leather pants? It's okay, whatever, I'll find some. This tea is really nice. I would really recommend tea. I've never really been a big fan of tea. I've always been more of a coffee kind of gal. But this is quite nice as long as you add a bit of coffee grunts into it. You know what I mean? And after school, I have another eye exam. It, it, it's just going to be a little recap on my contacts, see if I'm happy and satisfied with them. Which, I mean, yeah, the contacts, they are going quite fine. I mean, sometimes they make, like, blur my vision a lot, but, I mean, come on. My vision already kind of sucks. I discovered this thing called kaleidoscope vision, and that's practically, like, how I see the world. But, like, most of the time... It, it's 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 kind of like like forget about it a lot it's like how your like how your nose is like you, you can kind of see it but like only if you like actually focus on it and remember it see that's the way I feel about my hallucinations and stuff because you see my vision is actually heavily distorted it's just that I kind of see past that similar thing to having like when you, if you're like emo or something and your bangs cover your eyes like how I do a lot of the time sometimes I, I swoop them out but like a lot of people, there's a, mis there's a misconception that if you have like bangs or like hair covering your eyes, then you can't see through it. But actually, I don't even really notice that. It just, like, I, I, I forget that my hair is in my eyes and I can still clearly see out of this eye. 
You know what I mean? And no, I don't really, I, I probably do have a lot more to say, but I just kind of forgot. Oh yeah, wait, no, that's right, that's right. I'll do, I'll be doing more monster energy infusing stuff. Just need to wait till my dad's away. He doesn't know that I infuse stuff with monster energy. Oh, actually, he doesn't know that I drink monster energy. I'm not sure how he hasn't figured that out yet, but it's okay. Mm, that tea was really nice. Make sure to like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell so you get all of the latest updates. Bye-bye.